Bari and I am the assistant of Naveen Bari and welcome back to Bari Sabites. Hi, welcome to the second episode of Bari's Bites. I hope you enjoyed the first one. We are looking forward to more talking with you. At the start, I would like to excuse the, the way that I talk. This is a legacy from my strokes. It was a pretty challenging road to recovery, to learn how to speak and match my thinking with my speech. This is the way that I have learnt or relearnt to speak. English is a language which is spoken slowly. I took it literally and spoke more slowly than normal. My journey to recovery started after my angioplasty. I weighed in at 98 kgs, 28 or maybe 30 percent body fat and I read, I had time in my hands, my mind was working, where would I go wrong? I was always athletic, I was with, uh, working with fitness brands in the Middle East and I was exercising. So where did I go wrong? And my quest to re rectify and rework my body started. I read and I read and I looked on the videos in YouTube and lots of material to search and learn. Then I found intermittent fasting. It is not a quick fix. It is a lifestyle change. We have been taught since young that eat, eat, you will grow up faster if you eat three meals, five meals, six meals. That is the best way that you could eat. Breakfast, a snack, lunch, a snack, dinner. That made you bigger and bigger and better. It is not true. It doesn't work like that. Your body was not made to eat five or six meals in a day. And I learned that after intermittent fasting. I had to change my lifestyle and not my diet. I first calculated how many calories I needed in a day, which everybody calculates how many calories is your diet, but how many calories you need. That was the first thing that I calculated. And then I work my diet around that. With intermittent fasting, you will always have deficit calories. Deficit calories means that if you needed 2000 or 2000 calories, 2500 calories, you would have a little less than that. And you would burn fat. Your body has to learn or relearn how to burn fat. It's simple. The body will burn carbs to store as fat and the body will burn fat for energy. We have to relearn how to burn fat for energy. It is not 
a high jump or a long jump you or a sprint you are in a marathon to work or rework your body and your mind it is mind over matter mind is stronger believe me the mind is stronger next time we'll talk about how you can fast for 12 14 16 18 hours without a problem again i am not a qualified doctor or a nutritionist i am talking about my experiences with intermittent fasting now my assistant would like to say something aishi thank you for watching this video we are looking forward to talk to you more but if you're new please like and subscribe and share to everyone thank you thank you see you in the next episode Thank you.